Hello Team Business Forum members, I'm here with Rob Salkowitz. Today we are joined by author Rob Salkowitz, the author most recently of Young World Rising, how youth, technology, and entrepreneurship are changing the world from the bottom up. Uh, he's an author, consulting entrepreneur, and specializing in social and next generation technologies. Well, half the world's population today is under the age of 30, but a lot of the youngest people live in some of the world's poorest countries. And, you know, just even a decade, decade and a half ago, that's a recipe for bad news. But what's changed is that there's been the spread of information technology networks that allow these young people to connect to communities, to new sources of information, to new resources that empower them in ways that they've never seen before. So Suhas is great. He was uh, uh, 14 years old, young kid in, in Bangalore from a uh, humble background. And he started working after school at a cyber cafe, taught himself to do web development, and started a business for himself creating websites for businesses in the US, uh, particularly small manufacturers that had an email address but no website. So he would email these folks and say, I'm Mr. Gopinath from India. I'd like to order 10,000 of your widgets please direct me to your website. And they would say, well, we don't have a website, but we have a catalog. And he'd say, I'm sorry, you don't meet my supply standards. By the way, would you like to buy a website? And he's grown his company into a global company. He's in 12 different countries. It's a multi-million dollar concern. And he is uh, the youngest member of the World Economic Forum. You know, what can you say to them? Um, number one, I wish you all the success. Like, uh, we need that innovation, we need that economic energy, we need this huge generation of people with, you know, willing to take risks and willing to put their ideas out there because frankly the, the old ideas in our society right now are stale and rotten and they're getting us nowhere. So please come forward with your new ideas and be huge success with it. Um, also take comfort and inspiration from your peers elsewhere in the world who are overcoming challenges and barriers and limitations that we can't possibly imagine and making successful businesses against very long odds. If they can do it, you can do it. And, uh, you know, the, the, as bad as things look sometimes in this country, uh, for younger people especially, uh, we still have it pretty good. Take advantage of those opportunities and make your business a success.